a five-door version of the Audi S5 Coupe, for exactly the same £47,000 price tag, and what's not to like about that? Well, not a lot, it turns out. While the Audi S5 Sportback uses exactly the same 349bhp, turbocharged 3.0 V6, 8 SPD Tiptronic and permanent Quattro 4-wheel drive setup as the coupe, it does have a 6 cm longer wheelbase, so there is a bit more to it than just the extra doors. Given the interior benefits of the S5 Sportback, you'd have to really want the more purposeful looks of the coupe to plump for that instead. Three passengers in the back of the Sportback is going to be a bit uncomfortable, but two adults will have decent legroom even behind a tall driver, while headroom is a bit more at a premium but will be okay for sub 6 footers. The boot is a good size, deeper than you might expect and with a good floor space, so it'll be big enough for whatever boot fillings an A5 Sportback buyer is likely to be concerned with. The 40 20 40 split rear bench also fold down to leave a smooth, long load bay, so it'll manage for the odd IKEA trip as well. Everything in the driver's environment is seriously impressive. You get the 8.3-inch screen with sat-nav, dab and two USB inputs, as well as electrically adjustable, heated Nappa leather sports seats, and a long list of other comfort and safety features as standard, so you don't need to plunder the options list even though you probably will. It'd be very easy at this point to start muttering about niche choices. But in reality, this is not a niche list of requirements at all, and if it happens to match your wants and needs, then the S5 Sportback is a very fine choice. Comfortable yet sporty-ish, practical yet sleek, rampantly fast yet with the potential to do a fair economy when you hit the motorway.